Hello dear traders, today is the 2nd of April. I'm Anna Kasatkin and here with the latest financial news release on Insta TV. Short work week ahead of Catholic Easter was full of surprises and not only pleasant ones. The report on ADP employment change that was released yesterday made the US dollar fall. Automatic data processing calculations showed that the US private sector added only 189,000 vacancies. The result was worse than the forecasts. What is more, the print tumbled lower than the score of 200,000 for the first time since January of 2014. The ADP's publication does not take into account changes in the public sector, but it is still a bellwether of the official statistics. Analysts shut their eyes to the U.S. economy's weakness, assuring that the strong labor market will boost it sooner or later. However, the yesterday's report prompted new worries. Low business confidence and decreased employment growth may mean that enterprises began preparing for a decline or slowdown of growth rates. Right after the report, the U.S. dollar lost its earlier gains. The only pair where the U.S. dollar managed to hover above the close level was the one with the British pound. In the early U.S. deals, the quote stayed at the level of 1.4777. Bearish sentiment on the pound was supported by the manufacturing PMI data of the United Kingdom. The print did not meet the expectations, but still inched up to 54.4. However, the U.S. currency's sell-off stopped promptly despite an unexpected fall in the ISM manufacturing PMI. And this was Daily Financial News on Insta TV. Stay tuned.